Go easy. I meet him again. This definitely isn't the second time I've played this now, because for some reason OBS decided to not work. Pretty much. Hopefully it's working this time, because I'm not going to record it a third time. Final report of the commercial starship Nostromo. Third officer reporting. The other members of the crew. Kane. Lambert. Parker. Brett. Ash. And Captain Dallas. Are dead. Cargo and ship destroyed. I should reach the frontier in about six weeks. With a little luck, the network will pick me up. This is Ripley. Last survivor of the Nostromo. Signing off. I'm Samuels. I work for the company. It's about your mother. We think we may have found her, Amanda. A commercial vessel, the Anisadora, has recovered what we believe to be the flight recorder unit of the Nostromo. Where? Zeta Reticula. What did it tell you? We don't know. The unit was taken to Sevastopol Station. It's proprietorial material, so the company wants it to be collected as soon as possible. Sevastopol's a supply depot in the region. It's a, a permanent freeport port. I know what it is. Transit's arranged. There's a courier ship called the Torrens heading out that way in two days. We're going to travel out. We? Oui. Me and another exec. And you, if you're willing. Look, Ripley, when this job came across my desk, I read the case history. I know why you're working in the region where she went missing. You're still looking, aren't you? I've been cleared to offer you a place on the Torrents if you want to come along. Maybe there'll be some closure for you. So yeah, welcome to Alien Isolation. Now I'm playing this because I want to start getting a schedule down for YouTube. 
I'm thinking every third day or so I'll swap it out because I'll usually do let's plays a couple days and then I'll do something different and we'll repeat that so today we start something I'm dreading which is I want to do a horror game every few days like once a week or so but yeah since I'm I I fucking hate horror games and movies it's by far my least favorite genre in anything so yeah sorry if my um my reaction will be pretty ungenuine is the word since I literally just finished doing this and then realized that OBS didn't want to record the actual game so that's always fun I even went through and read the um, terminals and that because I was interested I don't really feel like reading them again unfortunately Uh, I actually might just read him again. Taylor, good morning. It's not that bad. Ripley, it's certainly not good. I very much doubt it's morning either. Sorry. I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You get used to it. I don't do long haul very often. Most legal execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Waylon Yutani felt the need to send legal at all. The loss of the Nostromo and its cargo cost the company a lot of money. It's important we find out what happened. If I can close the case with a conclusive accident report, it'll look great with my superiors. I'm sorry. That was insensitive. I realize your mother has been missing for 15 years and, and you... It's okay. We'll both get what we want, right? Uh, have you seen Samuels? He's probably been up for hours. I'll catch up with him. Okay, but yeah, I want to um, do a horror game every now and then, so let me know if there's any games you guys want me to play, I'll happily have a squeeze at them. But yeah, my god, the atmosphere in this game is fucking horrifying. Oh. Ripley. I Samuels. don't like it one bit. Did you wake up from early? The well, I don't half know hour or so I played as the rest of you. I was just inspecting the Torrens facilities, a well-maintained ship. I realize it's a very similar model to the Nostromo. Yes, M-class. A later pattern, but close in spec. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. Is Taylor up yet? She's not a seasoned traveler. Hypersleep may have been punishing for her. We talked. She seems nervous. Hmm. I hadn't noticed. She's a skilled executive, though. Should help us with any legal issues we might encounter. Right. All personnel to the bridge. Approaching Sevastopol Station. Looks like we're up. So, from my very brief understanding of the game at the moment, the, um... Basically, the depot that we're going to at the moment, like the ship, has... They were supposed to get decommissioned, which I'd imagine means, like, they were getting fired. But it doesn't seem like they actually escaped, so... I guess we're going to find out if they actually died or if they got off the ship. Hope you all had a restful journey. The Torrens is in very good order for an old M-Class captain. She was a wreck when I bought her. Took a few years and a lot of contracts to refit. She pays for herself now. You said we're approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we docking? I believe your contact is Marshal Waits, is that right? I'll hail Sevastopol and arrange boarding with him. Good. Let's get this done. Don't worry, Miss Taylor. Routine. In and out. Connor, how are we doing? SMG loaded and calibrated. Approach vector locked. Prep comm so I can say hello. Channel open, Captain. Does everyone have their briefing documents? You can watch the approach on the monitors. Can we 
see it. Switch to monitors. Sevastopol Station. Is that damage? It looks like damage. Punch up 74, tight angle. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. I can't bring the Torrens into that. This is the commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV7760, calling Sevastopol traffic control. We're carrying three passengers on a whaling. Yutani Bond, you're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers portside over. <laughs> Marshall? Mar Marshall, this is the Torrens. Say again. The station's comms seem pretty screwed up, so our fitted Samuel suit with a radio booster. I can only keep the Torrens in transit for 24 hours. You'll have heard from us by then. Safe trip. Stand by. My contract doesn't cover bloody spacewalks. It's the only option. And it's perfectly safe if you do what I tell you. Just shout on me, Taylor. You too, Samuels. Affirmative. Fuck happened here? My God, Ripley. You're doing good, Taylor. <laughs> Just keep moving! <laughs> Oh, they're dead already. Samuel! Taylor! Respond! Anybody! What a good start to a fucking horror game. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, and I've honestly never seen any of the Predator or Alien movies properly. I've only played the 2010 version of the game, and that was recently. So I somewhat know what's coming in regards to the Alien, and I really don't like the um, fun house that it has to play with here. <laughs> Find help. It's a great first objective when you get onto a uh, seemingly abandoned ship. And I don't know why you can turn so fast when you're on the save points. You can't turn fast everywhere else. This made me shit myself just earlier, I'm not gonna lie. We're very quickly approaching the point where I have to end the episode though, because I obviously went through and read everything. And now we're permanently crouching. Not sure why they did that.
What was that? Sensor. Nothing on there. Oh yeah, you... Seems there's a peak mechanic too, so... <laughs> shit's gonna get real scary. I think this is the terminal that tells you they're supposed to be decommissions? Yeah, decommissioning. So, boys and girls, you've probably heard the whispers about Sevestable by now. And I can confirm it's official. Sevestable is being decommissioned. I will go over with each of you what this means in regards to your contracts and next placement. But for now, we still have a job to do. The suits want this done with a skeleton crew, which means we'll only be getting a few outside contractors to help. But it does mean overtime. I recommend taking what you can while it's available. I should point out that the decommission does not mean lucky dip. Everything here has to be accounted for and I will personally escort anyone found helping themselves to equipment to martial weights. Chief. So yeah, it seems that they all got fired. And there's a little jump scare here that I fucking hate. and fucking hurt yourself. God damn. This'll help. I mean, I don't know what the flare is used for here, because I accidentally dropped it on the floor as soon as I got out here. So it's just on the floor there. And I didn't go forward last time, so... We'll see what happens. Because I went up there. Straight away. Because you go up there and climb up the ladder. I can actually go this way. I don't know what that does yet. I know there's a slight crafting mechanic in the game. Oh my god, I just tap shift to get up. How do I go back down? See, okay. I couldn't figure out how to fucking stand up before. So I was just walking everywhere. Oh, shift is actually run. I don't like that I know how to run now. <laughs> Keep moving. Yeah. Bit annoying that the game didn't tell me how to stand up before. Hello? So I was literally just walking hey, everywhere. Man. This life for rent, forgetful, forgotten. Fuck you. Tomorrow, no together, help. Welcome to the end of the line. No, panic, 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 panic. Oh. Saved. Crank this shit. Uh, mash the button three times. Uh, yeah. This has a password to the door that we just saw. Yeah, Langley, if you're looking for our stash, I've moved it. You left it right out in the open where anyone could have taken it. Jesus, do you know what I had to do to get it? I've hidden it in one of the storerooms. You should be able to find it. The code is 0340. Don't worry, no one goes down the terminal anymore. Not after what happens. Also, we're out of meds and low on water, so you're going to need to get some. It's your turn. Maybe 
it'll teach you to take care of our stuff in future. We've had a long journey together, but sadly it's coming to an end. Siegson Corp would like to take this opportunity to thank all of you who worked and lived in Sevastopol over the years. It hopes that Siegson has helped to make it a productive and rewarding environment. Our investment and belief in the station has never wavered. Be assured that Siegson's Apollo Central AI and working Joe androids will be there to serve Sevastopol until the last rivet is removed. We wish you all the very best for the future. After all, Sevastopol isn't just a station, it's people. Seeks and Corp. Audio, kill the power. Wait, can I? Harris, turn oh my god, I could have just been now. doing that. We have a track somewhere in engineering. Lock the terminal down, kill the power, and don't forget your reports. Make them thorough. We're gonna need our paperwork to be bulletproof when this shit's over. Wait's up. What did I do? What the fuck is going on? Um... That's... That's not... Um, okay, now I'm a little bit horrified. When I played it, I didn't go through that terminal. I literally went through this storeroom up here with her code and then didn't know what to do. Please don't be right there. I'm actually so flustered from that, holy fuck. Oh yeah, and if you guys end up liking this kind of stuff, I will go invest in a face cam just for this stuff, but I'd honestly rather not use face cams as I like the anon anonymity of not knowing what someone looks like when I'm watching. click these and then you click this. I have a feeling I'll actually need to use this this time. Come on, put it in your hand. There you go. Yeah. Get roided up. Um But yeah, I I don't like that these doors are open. Because I know the one back there opened as well. Where did these people even run to? The door's locked. But yeah, I had massive goosebumps walking through this. That is a very large door. So yeah, this is all new territory now. No, please. Okay, it stopped. I went to the one I can't go through. I can crawl. No. <laughs> can I go in here? No. Tomorrow, no, together, future. 
a polo. Space flight terminal. Oh my god, please no. Try and kill me, doors. What the hell happened? I don't want to wanna know. Okay, at least it can. Why did the music pick up? Stop that. Baggage claim. Help. Cancelled. Strangers will be shot. E. Is that a turret there? No, it's binoculars. You always no working. The turrets. I'm here. I'm right here. We're lame. Contact the torrents. What? That breathing's loud. You always know a working Joe. Welcome to the end of the line. Safe point in there. What? Why can't I go across there? Guess I'm going this way. <laughs> We need help. I don't know if I want to restore the power here. <laughs> I guess I don't have a choice. Is there a light there? Oh, 
or the door opened. <sighs> There's something in that room. Give me this fucking save point. Please no. Please no. Okay, I got the save point. Let's see what happened here. Pulling the plug. Zoe, I'm sorry, but I won't need you to come in next week. As you know, the, sto the store's been in trouble for some time now and I couldn't hold off the credit creditors any longer. There's just no one coming to Sevastopol anymore. It's not just us either. It sounds like the whole station is in the red, and they're pulling the plug. Going to sell it off for scrap, I reckon. I was speaking to one of the engineers, and he reckons they'll announce it soon. I'm telling you, this so you don't stick around looking for another job. Sevastopol's finished. Time to move on, Harper. Oh my god, there's... Okay, that's fine. To all spaceflight terminal employees, in the interest of public safety and the prevention of panic, it must be made clear to all potential passengers that there are currently no scheduled flights leaving Sevastopol, not, nor ships available. The Colonial Marshals are investigating problems on station and will update accordingly from the office of Marshal Waits. What is Apollo? Apollo is the central AI that monitors and provides guidance for all the SIGs and working Joes on Sevastopol. Apollo oversees all communications on the station so wherever you are you know you're in safe hands. SIGs and tomorrow together. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it at all because this is clearly a safe spot too. It's clearly a safe area. Which means whatever's gonna happen is gonna happen soon. Because they don't just put a save point in there with nothing in there. I hate this so much. Keep out. Someone new. Rip Sevastopol. Kidding. Forgotten. Fuck you. Help. Okay, that door is open.
Oh, it's just a light. No hospital, no authority, no hope. Looters will pay. All departures. Some scrap, no. Another save point. Nice. I'm guessing I go the right side because the right side had a red light before. Yeah, it's still a red light. No red light on that one. Um, I don't know if I'm going backwards or not. I can't remember what the mission was but that'll have to do it for this video and we'll probably get probably shit ourselves if you guys enjoy the series and want to see another video on this I fucking hate it so I hope you don't <laughs> I will see you guys in the next one. Be sure to let me know what horror games you would like to see me incorporate. I do have a few of my own on the list, which I'll be going through. But yeah, definitely let me know if you want to see me play something. Yo, yo.